This is a video for everyone who wants to build great dApps and who wants to build them quickly. Because in this video, I will show you the tools, the libraries, the SDKs you need. And also, I will show you a full boilerplate project which you can just download and run and you will have the most basic features that all dApps on all chains need. Now, maybe you are a mobile developer, maybe you are a web developer and you're just getting into crypto. Then you have found the exactly correct video because in this video I will be showing you Morales. Morales is kind of like Firebase for crypto. It is kind of like Firebase for crypto because it is a full stack solution where you as a developer, you don't need to care about the backend. You don't need to scale the backend. You don't need to provision databases. You don't need to connect to RPC nodes and get the data from them. You don't do any of that. And yet you get all the features that all dApps need. For example, how to log in a user on any blockchain and how to get all of their assets, all of their NFTs, all of their transactions, all of their history and all their real-time transactions without caring about anything except for logging in the user with one line of code like this. And as soon as the user is logged in, you have everything in your Morales database already served on a, on a silver plate. All the balances, all the NFTs, everything, everything, everything. And this works cross-chain. So if the user logs in on Solana or the user logs in on Avalanche or on Binance Chain or on Polygon or on Ethereum, it all just works by default. Let's say you want to log in a user with email and then you want to add crypto addresses to their profile. You can easily do that. What if you want to get a bunch of data about NFTs, you can easily do that with our NFT functions in the API. And this API that we have, this SDK, it works on um, JavaScript platforms like React. And this is what I will show you next, how to easily use this with React. But also this works with Angular, this works with Vue.js, it works with Unity SDK. We're soon releasing a C-sharp client for Unity. We're soon releasing native clients for iOS and Android and already today you can use React Native in order to to build all of this, so in order to use all of this in your uh, applications. So this is what we mean when we say that Morales is kind of like Firebase because it is a managed solution. You just log in, you create an account here in Morales. Then when you log in, you create a server. Let me show you how it looks like. It's actually very easy, especially if you've been building uh, websites, if you've been building mobile apps in the past and you have used something like Firebase. So if I'm to show you here, this is my account in, in Morales. As you can see, I do have servers here. Uh, here is the screen. Uh, and this server, I can configure how I want. I can select which blockchain I want, whether I want Ethereum, Polygon, Binance Chain, Avalanche, or any other chain that we're adding soon. And then when you have it running, you can go and you can see in the database all your users and all their transactions will be populated in real time, by the way. So here's, for example, all my users, I have 16 users, here are all their transactions, here are all their NFTs, here are all their NFT transfers. I can add extra data to this if I want, I can modify these columns however I want. And um, here you have your server URL, application ID. Using this, you can now connect to the SDK so you can connect SDK to the server via these two pieces of information, application ID, server URL, uh, and you can see it in our docs. If you go to docs.morales.io, you can find it and you can follow this getting started tutorial in order to understand the basics. And let's say you want already a border plate, a finished border plate with the most important things, such as, for example, the wallet. If you're building a dApp, no matter which chain, it will need some kind of wallet so people can send assets back and forth. So, or if you want some kind of balance table already finished, you can get that. This border plate has everything you need. Uh, this is the standard interface that all dApps need. And we have all of the hooks here for all of the different UI elements like address, address input, uh, chain select selection UI, and so on and so forth, DEX UI. So you can find this by Googling Ethereum border plate let me actually show it to Ethereum border plate. You can Google and you can easily find it. It's usually the first result. Uh, if you go here, you find this. And we're building this all the time, by the way. We're building this all the time. So when you come here, please leave us a star if you appreciate it and if it helps you. And then if it is the case that you have any questions or any problems, I will link a link in the description so that you can ask us questions. Because as you can see, we have a very active community. And in this community, we have a very special thread for Ethereum boilerplate questions. So I will link this thread so that in case you have any 
problems, any questions like this person, for example, has any questions about the boilerplate, you can ask them and we will help you because we are full-time devs in this in this thread helping you all the time. Like for example, Loco the Dev or Yomo or CryptoKid, we have a lot of them just answering you all the time. So please don't hesitate to reach out if you have any problems running this this borrow plate, because this borrow plate, it's mind-blowing. It is life-changing. It has all of the basic features. You save 90 plus, but, uh, 90 plus percent of your development time if you use this borrow plate instead of building yourself. And most importantly, soon you can self-host. This is a big difference between Firebase and what we're doing, because as you know, in Firebase, if you've used it for traditional web or mobile, you cannot self-host. You need to be Google's client. But here, you will be able to self-host it soon. So this is a community project. This is a community effort. And you're part of this community. If you come to this GitHub repository, you leave a star and you start interacting with the community. So please join us as soon as possible. Also, you can join Discord using the link below and activate yourself. Be part of this community. We're very welcoming. We're here to help. As you can see, for example, here is uh, we're switching networks. So I just want to comment here quickly that you saw different NFTs because the networks were, were different. And uh, this is just the beginning, guys. Uh, so if you know React, this is for you. Soon we are releasing React Native Boreal Plate. We have already a React Native Boreal Plate, but we still need to polish it. As you can see, it's not as pretty as the React Boreal Plate. So we're still working on that. It's going to be soon. And next is going to be Unity. So soon we, you can build games and metaverse experiences very, very easily. So I hope you be, become part of our community. I hope you contribute to this community. I hope that you join the forum, join the Discord, smash the like, subscribe. See you all very, very soon on this channel. If you go to our channel and you see what kind of videos we post, we post blockchain web three programming videos each and every day so you will never never waste time when you look at one of our videos you will always learn you will each each and every second of our videos your brain will get smarter and smarter you will get more and more knowledge you will be more and more powerful developer you will be able to achieve more and more and more because that's our motto when somebody watches our video we ensure that they never waste time they always come out smarter more powerful more experienced more aware and they can build better things so that's our mission if you like that smash the like subscribe and i'll see you all very very soon